Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So today is going to be a hair tutorial. So I'm starting off with my hair of course. My hair is very dry and coarse. So if you guys could recommend any treatments that would be great. I also need a trim. So if you guys know any natural hair salons in London, please leave them down below. So I'm just going to apply gel to my hair basically. So I'm using the Eco Styler gel and the one that I'm using is the olive oil one. So I'm just applying that around my head and I'm gonna take my hard bristle brush and I'm just gonna brush that all in just to get everything nice and smooth. Now that's done I'm just gonna go ahead and put my hair in a bun you want to tie it where you feel best suits you and I'm using one of the hair bands that don't have the metal things so it doesn't pull on my hair so I'm just gonna go in again and kind of smooth out any areas that kind of need to be a bit more flat and I guess apply more products where you feel is necessary I'm then gonna go ahead and twist my puff and just wrap that around so the swatch, swatch, goth, I can't even say it, swatch, goth, <laughs> spiking glue seems to be the only thing that works for my edges. I absolutely love it. So I'm just applying that to my hair and then brushing that in. So my braids did mess up my edges just a little bit, but I'm just taking some mascara and I'm just applying that to my hairline. And this is just going to make my hairline appear a lot more fuller and I'm also just going to apply some more of the gel just to sort of blend in that mascara. Now this is my secret weapon if you have really thick coarse hair like mine get this like guys you will thank me so I'm just going to spray that on my head and then I'm going to put my head scarf and I'm just going to leave that to set for a couple of hours so i'm using leftover hair from my braids and the brand that i'm using is expressions i always use this brand now my hair is already pulled i'm not quite sure how to explain it but a lot of african hairdressers do this to the extensions this ensures that the extensions look natural towards the end and it gives it a feathered kind of look now i'm going to section off the hair into three because obviously I'm going to braid it and I did leave some because I'm going to wrap that around my bun so then you just want to go ahead and do your braid you want to braid very loosely If you want your braid to be much bigger then you're more than welcome to go ahead and use more hair. I'm just going to secure the end of my braid with a hairband. Then I'm going to go in and just kind of make my braid a little bit bigger just by pulling on it gently. Now taking the hair that we left out earlier, I'm just going to take that and wrap that around my bun. And this is going to conceal the hairband and also create a really nice space for our jumbo braid. Okay, so once that's done, you want to open up your braid to cover your bun. Then you want to go ahead and secure that in place. I wanted my base to be a little bit more thicker, a little thicker. So I did go ahead and apply more hair. And of course you want to go ahead and secure that with a bobby pin and we are all done i hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you for watching don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you did enjoy it and i will speak to you all in my next one